How are you on Saturday, July 20, 31st, 2021, 1.30 in the afternoon? Episode Guide, Baseball Hall of Fame, focusing on pitchers. Episode 188, Early Win, Hall of Fame, 1939-1963. 23 years, he won 300 games exactly. The same as Lefty Grove. There are two guys in the Hall of Fame. Did you know that? That have won 300 games exactly. Lefty Grove and Early Win. How about that? 300 on the nose. 551 winning percentage, 3.54. ERA, 289 complete games, very good. 49 shutouts, very good. 4,564 innings. If you pass 4,000 innings, you're all-star. 2,334 strikeouts. So how did early win get into the Hall of Fame? Well, 300 wins is automatic. Came in 1939, 19 years old. Washington Senators. Then he played for Cleveland, Chicago White Sox. First year 0 and 2. Second year 3 and 1. Third year 10 and 16. 1943 18 and 12. 1944 8 and 17. 1945 he missed a year. So as a 25 years old. He went in the military for just one year. <clears throat> Came back, 1946, 8 and 5. S then 17 and 15, 8 and 19, 11 and 7, 18 and 8. 1951, 31 years old, he wins 20 games, 20 and 13. Then he goes 23 and 12, 17 and 12. 1954, 23 and 11. Then he goes 17 and 11, 1956, 20 and 9. This will be his fourth 20 winning season, 20 win season. 1957, 14 and 17, 58 season, 14 and 60. 1959, 39 years old, early win, 22 and 10. So he has five 20 win seasons. 1960, 13 and 12. Then he goes 8 and 2, 7 and 15. And then his last year, 43 years old, 1 and 2. So I like early win, 300 wins on the nose. <laughs> 1963 season, he won one game. He said, hey, manager, I got to win one game. So I'll have 300 for my career. I like it. 4,564 innings for early win. All right, next on the countdown, I'm going to start doing dominant pitchers. And you've heard of this guy, Bob Gibson, St. Louis Cardinals. Thanks for watching. I'm out.